Democrat wishes Republicans' family would die from Legionnaire's disease. A Democrat lawmaker is squirming after comments she made against a Republican. After wishing his family would die from Legionnaire's disease, she's clarifying her remarks. However, not many are buying her explanation. Liberals have three surefire debate enders and none of them involve being armed with the facts. The first thing they do is accuse their opponent of being a racist, fascist Nazi. If that doesn't work they shout obscenities in place of reason or logic. Finally, if they are still on the losing end of the debate they threaten violence and forward slash or death. 10 Unexpected Ways to Add Years to Your Life A Democratic Illinois state lawmaker skipped steps 1 and 2, going straight to the death threats when she wished a Republican's family would die from Legionnaire's disease. The Chicago Sun-Times reports that state lawmakers were voting to override government. Bruce Rauner's veto of a bill that would increase the cap the state pays out in civil litigation cases from $100,000 to $2 million. The bill was meant to help the victims' families from a Legionnaire's disease outbreak that killed 13 people at the Illinois Veterans Home. Outgoing Republican House Floor Leader Republic Peter Breen wanted legislators to consider the bill a bit further before voting, saying, we don't even know how much this bill is going to cost. Democrats don't care how much things cost and hate being told they can't shovel taxpayer money into the furnace, so Republic. Stephanie Kifowit laid into Breen with her disturbing statement. To the representative from Lombard, I would like to make him a broth of Legionella and pump it into the water system of his loved one so that they can be